Okay, an unbelievable amount of landmarks in this place. We're finally getting to the last one. We got three more. Okay, Broken Dog. I imagine that isn't a fucking god. That's a terrible name for an elven god. I intended to take a charcoal rubbing of the beautiful elven carvings on the stone to, rep to present to a scholar at the University of Orlais for translation. Unfortunately, halfway through the process, the chilling sensation of something brushing my leg beneath the dark water interrupted me. I dropped both scroll and charcoal stick and began running, not stopping until I was on dry ground. From a journey through the dales by Lord Horace... Ba -doop -ba -doop -ba -doop. So, what, leeches? Because that's kind of boring. Gotta be something down there. I was half expecting it to jump right out at me after I'd finished li reading. That would have been glorious, but I went, oh, go away. Is that what brushed against your leg? I think you would have noticed that coming up to you before it brushed your damn leg. Well, I'm going to try to do this without disturbing the terrifying dragon that I just noticed was hanging out over there. I, 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 I'm not, I'm not down for a dragon fight of this caliber. We could maybe do the one in the storm, <coughs> the storm coast or like, uh, God, where else was there a dragon? There were a lot of dra- I think there was- there wasn't one in Fallowmire, was there? I wonder how many there are total. Uh, offering to the Dreadwolf. Ooh. The Dalish believe that Fen'Harl, the Dreadwolf, locks the gods of good and evil away. Only he walks free. Although they see him as a betrayer, elves still erect shrines to Fen'Harl. One imagines they do revere him- They do not revere him so much as seek to appease him, lest they draw his gaze. It's been a while since we've seen you, Big Boy Jenna TV. How I have missed my man. Um, yeah, over there, dragon. Over here, probably endless demon. Oh, cut! What? What even? We're not in combat. So what's gonna happen? You're just gonna get up and remain in the poisonous water? Yep. That's exactly what's gonna happen. The Inquisitor is an e is in an endless death loop of being poisoned by what I can only assume is a random rock. Uh, okay. Dragon Age Inquisition, everybody. Dragon Age Inquisition. Sad to say, the best Bioware has had to offer in quite some time. No, I think, honestly, I I may slightly, so far, I should say so far, because I probably won't mean it as soon as I go back to make the main quest again. Because when I'm doing the main quest, I absolutely adore it. But I have to say, so far, Andromeda is better. Andromeda is a better game than Dragon Age Inquisition so far. Uh, but that's not sad enough fun, because I enjoy Andromeda. I think Andromeda is like a 7 out of 10. Inquisition is either a 2 out of 10 or a 10 out of 10, or occasionally somewhere in the middle. It's probably like, in total at the moment, a 6. I really don't understand how this game got 10 out of 10s when it came out. Maybe it- I was about to say, maybe it was less buggy, but that makes zero sense in, in, entirely. How maybe console versions are better? And it was probably, at the time, one of the- no, that's a complete lie. I was about to say one of the uh, biggest RPGs um, to make it to console, but that's a complete fucking lie. Like, like Oblivion and Skyrim had made it to uh, had made it to consoles many, many years prior. I don't know what that I'm talking about, but if for some reason you can't climb up here. Great, invisible walls, everybody's favorite. Let's get the fuck out of here, dude. Riverside Garrison. Uh, Cassandra's done her thing. Should I drop her off? We've had a lot of Cassandra recently. Might bring out Blackwall or something like that. Okay, I think, uh, companion dialogue may have started right as I opened this menu. So, I could be very, very wrong about that. But I heard like a, eh. I don't even know who's speaking. But I'm hoping for the best. Yay! No, it's summer, Liddy. This thing you do. Maybe you should stop doing it. Got her a flower, but they Why, Blackwall? He's doing his bed. best, sort of. He's terrifying, sword. isn't he? Tawny sands, a garden seat, five to Chantry altars, one to a child with her hair, the sea, too many to count, and 36 tossed off the battlements today. Go bother Solus. You have many things. <laughs> Solus actually I'm is sorry, it? Oh! Oh! Oh, wow! Did you have to read it out loud? Couldn't you have just, you know, thought about Blackwall's fuckery inside of your own stupid little mind? I, I thought Blackwall was being a bastard, but no! 
He was reading out Blackwall's thoughts. Well, that's horrible, buddy, and it sort of spoils it for when you eventually tell me, I guess, but maybe you were never going to tell me. Maybe, unless we happen to have that particular part of companion dialogue, you were forever going to remain the mysterious mustache. Who knows? Anyway, I will see you guys when we finally arrive at that bridge. I don't even know how repaired the bridge is. It doesn't appear whole on the map for some reason, but whatever. This is what cost me five power? You put a couple of sticks across. I could have done this. Like, it would have taken me less time and wouldn't have cost me anything to do this. Man, I thought you were going to rebuild the entire thing as it should be. This is embarrassing, you bastards. Uh, there's no actual main quest to do here, is there? It's just make the Dalish happy, I guess, for the Empire. Familiar ring. What else am I meant to be doing for the Dalish? Because they don't love me, love me, love me. Right? I don't think. Anyway, let's take a little look. God, there are so many places. Exalted Plains. Said exalt, Exalted... There we go. Ah... Oh, it's gone. The Making Friends of the Dalish Mission is gone. I, I guess they love us. I didn't even realize. Don't know when that happened, but fuck me, that looks absolutely terrifying. Why is the landscape trying to scare me now? This side is all just nice, happy, pretty, green. And then over there, it's death. Endless death. Ah, I'll stay on the nice, happy, pretty, green, please. Is everything here fucked? I believe I was meant to return a ring to someone. Would, would you, sir? Sir, would, would you like a ring? Does this benefit any of the corpses that are hanging around here? Jesus, at least they're pathetic. They're going down so quickly. Uh, I just wish we had an elemental mage. I really like Solus, but it, it sucks not being able to just set fire to the corpses. That's what makes everyone else so good. But to be fair, Dorian would probably be having a harder time than even Solus here, because corpses are the most annoying fucking things in the world, and for some reason are icy as all fuck and are immune to being frozen half the time. Because that makes all the sense in the world. If you're a dead person, you can't be cracked in half when you're an icicle. Apparently, don't know why that's a thing, but whatever, they just want to hurt Dorian's feelings. I don't have time to take on every last corpse that just happens to be buried here over the last forever. Ah, fine, fine. Let's burn them ourselves since we don't have a mage. I just like being able to do elemental damage as, well, as someone who isn't a mage. It's really, really useful. But it just doesn't last nearly as long as it should and actually says that it does. Oh, Solus is having such a hard time. You poor bastard. Do you have an ice, uh, stave? I don't actually know. Yeah, it looks pretty icy to me. Oh yeah, you have the Magister's one, don't you? Is that what I gave to you? Or do you use Tempest? I think we have staves better than that, my friend. Blizzard's Path. Why don't you try... Yeah, Tempest, I do have this. Oh my god, that's really, really nice. Ooh! Ooh, 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 but is that a... Dorian thing? It's a, bit, a little bit more Dorian to me. Plus 10 spirit down. Nah, fuck it. Why not? Oh, it looks the exact same. Of course it looks the exact same. Why wouldn't it look the exact same? Oh, wait, no, it doesn't. That was like a morning star. That's an actual dead man. Doesn't suit you in the slightest, Solus. But we will absolutely go for it. Man, did we really kill that many? Look at all those little dots on the ground there. I mean, on the map. Beautiful. Is there any reason to be taking it, though? Corpse art? Yeah, I guess. Rare materials and stuff, even if it is only level one. Ugh. Yeah. I think I will do some crafting in the next session. If I don't remember to do crafting, please feel free to kill me. Because I've been I've been meaning to do it for a long ass time and I just never get around it. What the fuck was that? Oh god, I thought I accidentally activated my thing. That would have been awful. We're missing one region. You think it's over here? Yeah, it must be, right? This place is a lot bigger than it seems. Well, it does seem like we could potentially go through there. If only I figure out how. Why are you all undead? There is meant to be at least one friend over here, right? Or maybe I have to bring everyone back here first? Why would I beat up a- What did I accomplish? I- I, I stabbed a haystack and it got mad at me. What, what, what was that for? Why was that a thing? Hello? Anyone? No? Fine. Alright, whatever. We kill the Arcane Aura. Everything goes back to normal. We've done this so many times. Thought there'd be something unique over here. Don't know why I expected that in this game, but whatever. 
I said, um, I said in the last session that I think I might need to take a little break from this game. And then I didn't take it today, and for the most part, no, to be honest, it's not really fair. For the most part, I'm still having a lot of fun. It's just, it's getting very repetitive, and I don't know if I should maybe take a break. Because I'm worried that I'm jump cutting things that I shouldn't be jump cutting. Because I was about to jump cut that. I was tempted because it's like, God, you guys have seen me do this to so many things. I'm sort of, I, I don't mind commentating over it. I'm still enjoying, you know, just murdering endless legions of demons. But uh, you guys have seen me do it over and over and over and over and over again. I don't know if I should be, because a lot of people are purists. A lot of people never want me to jump cut anything, and I know that. Um, and then some people are just like... I, I, I'm sure some people are just like, why the hell are you showing us the 80,000th rift? We are done with rifts, please. It's the same enemies that it's always been. So I did, I, I'm not really sure what to do about that. I'm worried I'm jump cutting a little bit too much. Uh, so if I am and it's getting annoying for you, I'm very, very sorry about that. But I, I hope you understand why. It's because it is the exact same in every location, every single time. Nothing changes. The demons never really progress. They're just more meat shieldy and do slightly more damage than they did in the last area, you know? It 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 it, it sure is a thing. Look at this genius combat. He literally doesn't do anything before he- Oh, no, he actually killed me that time. All right. He was literally just teleporting up and down, up and down, doing literally nothing. Even Cole's dead. I'm not dying here. I refuse to fucking die here. <laughs> I will not have it. Why is this man taking so many hits? It's really annoying me. He's not even fighting back now. I think he's ever- every now and then firing a little ball of doom off at fucking- You're right, Blackwall, Blackwall, Blackwall. Come here, you little arsehole. Wait, I, I don't- I can't? Then heal, dude! What the hell are you doing? I'm trying to barrier you! There we go. Alright, now we revive. What was that? That's not what I wanted. Now we revive Darwin. So we can hopefully do some more discreet damage to this prick. Are you actually moving for once? No, he has one area in the entire map that he can possibly go to for some reason. What is wrong with you? I don't know what this combat is! Let's take a big old stone fist, and can we just get out of here? I don't want you to turn on Solus. Luckily, no one ever notices Solus for some reason. Um, I'm gonna throw down another barrier. Is Darwin still alive? Darwin is still alive, somehow. I really hope this is one that actually gets like a little, hey, you're able to teleport here, because we're in a lot of pain right now, and I would prefer to be in a lot less pain. Boom, stone fist, die, please. Veil strike, hopefully that'll hit the barrier as well. I'll just make things ever so slightly faster in like two seconds when I actually get around to slaughtering it. Boom, do something. At least he's frozen. Oh, I could shatter him if I'm, a, if I'm a smart boy. No, I was like two seconds too late. Or was that just because he died from something else anyway? Huh. I'm literally breaking down an ice barrier with ice because they did not polish this game in the slightest. <laughs> there we go. Darwin lived somehow. AI rogues are starting to get not terrible. That's good to know. Veil strike. Ooh. I like it when it rips everyone down to the ground. That's cool. And I think I did just shatter that boy. All right. All right. All right. All right. Let everyone else deal with that. I'm going to set fire to the corpses if it lets me. It does. There's another one. I have to kill another arcane horror like that on my two potions. Uh-huh. I'm actually kind of getting decimated over here. I'm having to constantly play a solo so everything goes to hell. Hi, Revenant. Of course it's a Revenant. Why wouldn't it be a Revenant? Oh yeah, they can suck me in, can't they? I'm dead. I'm really, 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 really dead. Reach the stranded troops I would love to. That way I'm not entirely on my own here. Oh, fuck. Nope. Nope. Doesn't matter. I'll be on my own in hell anyway. Jesus Christ, man. I just gotta charge through all this bullshit. I don't know what to do. Huh. <sighs> Am I gonna respawn with some de with a decent amount of potions? Of course not. I'm gonna have to teleport away for a while. God damn. This game makes me suffer. Okay, this time that went a hell of a lot better. Somehow I only used two potions to get here. And everything's on fire, so... Let's see what the Revenant can do to us this time, when it's literally just him versus our absolute army. Come on, everyone's even got barriers, except Cole. 
who is probably the most important one to have a barrier on account of how fucking squishy he is. But whatever, fine, fine. Why did you dispel? Revenants have magic as well. This is overkill, come on. Revenants didn't need to be this good. This is like Dragon Age Origins level of Revenant, except actually still way worse. There would never be anything on the same level as the Dragon Age Origins Revenants. They were just so fucking terrifying at the start of the game. If I'm all icy, will he get frozen too if he hits me? He will, right? And I basically resist damage until then? Oh, this is so good. I'm starting to really like Tempest. I'm starting to really like playing as Darwin. When it works, it works really well. When it bugs the fuck out, it's terrible. But that is sort of just how it always is in this game, no matter what the hell you're using. So, there you go. Sometimes I have to dive away from combat just to keep my combo going, though. And then sometimes it doesn't work anyway. So that's slightly annoying. But oh well. We brought down a Revenant using, like, what? Two potions? Three potions? Not too bad. Render's Blade? This was a special Revenant. Oh, in which case, maybe it wasn't a very good Revenant. If that was a boss, then that was sad. Um, Render's Blade, it's a great sword. I just need to bring out Iron Bull. I'm noticing how long it's been because, um... We still have that Kunari hat that we found maybe two sessions ago <laughs> that I still haven't put on him. Mm. Water, there we go. Jesus fucking Christ. Sorry about that, I had to get another bottle. I don't know if I mentioned or not. Hello... Now what actually happens in here? It's gonna be a lot easier without the Revenant fucking literally everything up, isn't it? But... What? What even is that? These motherfuckers got lasers! Where's that even coming from? I do not like this. I do not like this in the slightest. Where are those troops? What do I do? Fine. Fine, we turn this place into our place, and only then will we relax and- Well, I don't know, is the laser gone? I will relax if the laser is gone, but I imagine this is just an endlessly respawning army of undead. Like it always is until you kill their dad or whatever the hell's going on. But I don't know where the hell that dad happens to be this time. Or- Oh, no, 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 leave me alone. Maybe I just have to set fire to their- Hay bale? And they stop coming? Is that how it works? I, I I don't know. It seems like there's supposed to be some kind of new game mechanic that I immediately understand, except I don't immediately understand it whatsoever. And it just leaves me immensely confused. Guys, guys, disengage. We're going this way. Fuck it. Somehow we only used a single potion there. Oh, what? It's all connected? What is this? What the hell is the point then? Oh, there's a dead guy here. Hey, dead guy. I noticed, they're trying to end me. Should I put you out of your misery? Oh, you put yourself out of your misery. Good for you, buddy. The thing you look like all the generic humans possibly could ever look. Uh oh. Oh, God, I hate it! I want to see what leads up, what, where that leads to, but at the same time, yeah, no. Yeah, no, I'm, I, I, I'm not taking that on. I'm not even on the ladder. What? What? Okay, but apparently I am. I don't know. It's such a weird <laughs> choice with like the uh, the glowy, lasery looking line, vector lines, whatever the hell, over the top of it. It just looks so wrong. Oh yeah, it was way better coming this way. Are you? At, are the defense is actually working on our behalf for once. And also, why is it just raining down from the heavens? What is that? How do I deal with that? Why is Solus not healing up? Oh god, you know, I'm, I'm running away. I, I don't want to deal with this. You're endless. I don't know what I'm supposed to do. No one is saying what I'm supposed to do. When I had Varric here, he was repeating the same lines over and over and over and over and over and over and over. Was it Varric? I don't think we ever took Varric here. Someone was repeating the same lines over and over. I think it was Blackwall, actually. He's basically just human Varric, except a bit less uh, humorous. Are you guys coming? That thing has already stopped being on fire. I can reuse those stupid fucking hay bales. This is clearly meant to be an epic fight with loads going on, but it's just some shambling undead with broken AI that doesn't know what it's doing. So, nothing ever really happens. Is that you, Cole? Why are you green? Is it so I can actually see you? Because obviously I follow the camera of myself. But then again, I never look green on when I'm playing as other people. As far as I remember. I, I, I don't know why I'm green. I don't know what's going on, dude. I just want this place to be over. This is... This may... This has tarnished the, the Exalted Plains a little bit for me. And I really like the Exalted Plains. But hopefully once we've captured this place and the undead fuck off forever, uh, that might go back to normal a little bit. What the hell's going on? 
Did I go all this way for no reason? That's a good start. Oh, yes, I landed it. It bugged out to all hell, but I actually landed it. Finally. Dense longbow. That doesn't sound good. It sounds like it's dumb. Why do we want a dumb bow? Oh, fuck, fuck. No, 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 no. Go, 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 go. Oh, this guy's nearly already dead. Hey! And my, uh, my barrier actually saved me from the painful, terrifying defenses. I'm surprised. And now I'm invisible, so let's just keep going. Yeah, I, I don't want to deal with all of these dudes. While there is also sky lasers raining down from literally nowhere, raining down from the heavens, Fenharal is not pleased with me today. I don't even want to save the Elysians out here, that's the thing. Like, that's Elysians in my Dalish areas. I, I, I don't appreciate the fact they're here in general, yet I have to save them. Why? What am I even doing here? It just says, reach this place. Well, well, I've done it. I'm here. What do you want now? Open the doors? Okay, I'll open the doors. Open by a mechanism. <laughs> Please don't tell me I have to go back and kill literally all of them. I will actually cry. Because this just seems like insanity. What is the... It's got to be somewhere around here. Right, my, uh, my dudes can do the fighting. I'm the least well-equipped to actually fight anyway. Except probably Cole. Ah, I see. Come on, open wide, motherfuckers. We've been able to push things in combat before. You remember the Siege of Haven, don't you, Darwin? There we go. All right, so we can just get this to open. Wait, what? what is this doing? The door isn't becoming any more open. What, what was that? Is it now going back? Is there other bits that I need to do? Or did it just all open at once? It all opened at once. Yeah, because that's how that would definitely work. Come on, come on, come on. We have four more potions. We just got to zip right past. Oh, rescue the troops. Yeah, I'm not doing that. Oh, I have to win this fight now, huh? I was not informed that I would need to fight when taking on a billion fucking demons. I thought it'd be a fork in the goddamn park. Which, for the most part, actually has been for me. I just sort of drifted right past all of them. But finally now, I gotta do something useful. Ugh. Oh, you know what? I don't have to do anything useful. The Void will do all the useful things for me. And also Blackwall. Blackwall will do a few of them. Why are you doing nothing? Why are you taking no damage? Come on, buddy. That did not last nearly long enough. Yeah, I need to get that focus ability. Man, Assassin looks so fun. When you just hit from like a billion angles at once, that looks so cool. Wait a minute. Why have we already got focus back? Is it because Darwin died immediately and it didn't quite register? Because that's amazing. All right, claim it. Boom! Citadel de, de Corbo. The large fortress known as Citadel de Corbo was claimed after the Second Exalted March. Originally an elven keep, the Elysians who seized it never truly dis never discovered its true name. Although they did find the magical wards the elves set in place. Mages of the Elysian Circle spent years studying these defenses. But the occupiers never fully understood them. Clearly, because even now they're trying to kill me while I save you. Ah, water. Water will sustain me. Water will sustain literally everyone on account of it being water, but you know. Corpse brain! I've got so much to pick through. I've got I've got so much stuff that I need to get here. Tempted to jump cut. You guys really want to see me fondle all the uh all the little corpse arts in? Is that uh is that doing it for you? You feeling it? You feeling a warm spot yet? I'm feeling a, a warm spot. I'll see you guys in a yes. sec. Oh, or not, or apparently. Good I timing, Blackwall. Like genuinely. Either way. I know you're dangerous. Yes. Oh, come uh, on, you. Blackwall. What? A sack on the side of the road, struggling. The boy runs from it, crying. Fine. So you're dangerous and insane. You would stop it if you could. What was Other the sack enough, on your road? But don't do it again. Huh? I, I have no idea. Uh, Cole confuses the fuck out of me. I find him really intriguing. I hope he has like a god tier loyalty mission that would make me very, very happy. Um, maybe I should go talk to him soon. Yes, that is that does tend to be what uh, guards do. I won't hurt anyone. I'm not here to hurt anyone. The Inquisition. Here. Forgive me, I should have known. Immediately opens up for fuck's sake. That was it? That could have been a badass, like, persuasion thing there, but no, no. Well, I mean, to be fair, they did see me kill all the demons outside, and they gave me a banner. Commander Yehan, or whatever the hell. Commander Here's a Shea, ring, I guess. In service of her imperial majesty, long may she reign. 
My men inform me Sounding that awfully the calm considering how deactivated. fucked you are. I cannot find are they? I, found I have your soldiers, soldiers rigged. Eastern ramparts. She wanted you to have this. Fabian's oh, you were together, weren't you? She's Maybe. Gone, then. I hoped, I prayed that she yet lived. Thank you. I, Maybe not. I will make sure this gets to her family. Tell me What's about been the What's been going on here? <coughs> there were orders. A chance for peace, they said. Pull back, they said. So we did. Then the urban dead appeared. We couldn't hold them back. I told my men to activate the fort's defenses. A foolish move. Well, that was a Born wonderful idea, wasn't it? There was so much about the old elven magic we never knew. We couldn't control it. We retreated. You killed everybody, including me, many times. I couldn't. I couldn't save them. We've been trapped for weeks. Supplies were incoming, but who knows what happened to them? There was no bridge money. until like five minutes ago. Have you given me a quest at all? Supplies, cash, fucking. A fetch quest for ten boxes. Purely for her to be like, thanks, Inquisitor. Here's ten XP. Bye. Dragon Age Inquisition. Well, okay, apparently people have already poured out and just defeated all the undead, which is nice. Are you gonna move the corpses, or is this a permanent decor decision? Because, uh, I don't recommend the corpses. Ain't particularly inviting. I don't know about maybe in Orle, your culture's different. You love a good rotting dead body in the morning. But here in the Dales, yeah, we, uh, get rid of the corpses, yeah. And where the hell is that final landmark? How far did I come? I feel like I ignored a hell of a lot of areas, and thereby a hell of a lot of loot. So I'm going to give this place a once over once I've done the whole landmark thing. Last landmark in the entire f fucking exalted plains. Hell yeah. Or not. Hell yeah? Yeah. Maybe. Hell yeah, it's down here. I don't actually know what I'm marking. This doesn't seem to be anything important. The raven. I don't see a raven anywhere, but sure. The mysterious hooded figure in Citadel de Corbo was nicknamed the Raven after the Second Exalted March. The human forces, unfamiliar with elven iconography, saw the shadow the statue cast upon the courtyard and imagined dark wings spread over the keep. Some years later, scholars of elven history hypothesized that the elves may have intended the sculpture as a representation of Dirthamen, the elven god of secrets. But I mean, he had crows. He wasn't a crow. Right? Did he just take on the form of a cr like how, you know, dogs start to look like their owners? Did the bird owners start to look like their bird? Do bird owners become a bird if they're exposed for too long? Oh! I see. Nicknamed the raven doesn't actually look like a raven. Why were you nicknamed the raven? Because it sounds like you were nicknamed by all Lesians. There's nothing raveny about you at all. Whatever, 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 whatever. I'm going to explore. Oh shit, okay, sorry, nearly missed that. I was in a pause menu. be a terrible thing. It was wrong to hide it in a What are you talking about? It hurt her. The two of you make no sense what? sometimes. That is a matter of respect. You mean Solus is also seeing this? I don't want to hiding a human head inside of a child? That needs explanation. Darwin, are you gonna say anything? Blackwall just has to deal with all this insanity. Sorry, buddy. I mean, you do have more authority than me. I don't have even a spec- I don't think elves can even grow facial hair. Look at that masterpiece. Alright, well, I'm literally just gonna be hopping around, hitting all these supply caches, because... Dragon Age Inquisition, everybody. <laughs> so, uh, yeah, it's gonna take me forever, so I'll see you guys when I'm no longer having to do all this bullshit. It, it's not even, like, tipped out anywhere. You guys just got bored and left your cucumbers behind. That was corn. I failed you all. I really can't get enough of how into tangerines Darwin must be. I love the music that plays as well, as if this is a really significant badass moment. And he just ah, and drives a stake into a fucking orange. It's it truly is a wonderful sight now, isn't it? All right, down to our last two, and I don't know why I came in at this one. It just it tickled me so very much. Here we go again. Here we go again. Defeat the corn, Darwin. Boom. There we go. 
I don't know why I came at this one. It just tickled me so much. Because now I have to... Oh no! It's... We're stealing from the Dalish. The Dalish took the corn. That's slightly worrying, isn't it? Or is it just a bit outside? Where is it? Yeah, I'm marking Dalish supplies. This feels wrong. Sorry, Dalish. Don't, uh, don't catch me doing this, okay? I hope he passes peacefully into the beyond. Yeah, we've already heard this many times. Shut up, I don't care about your brother. Um, pressed for cash. Hilarious. Um, it is always a pleasure can we now to trade tomorrow. with you? Do you have anything to trade? Can we trade? Take a look if you like. Yay! We can do it. Do the Dalish actually have anything unique? It's more corn. Why is everything in this world corn? Witch fire stuff, stuff of flares, and charts of lightning stuff, witch lightning stuff, volcanic stuff, blah 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 blah. Any good armor? Robes of the High Keeper. Oh. Oh. Shit. I. Yeah. Yeah, that's nice. I can afford this. It's double. It's double the armor, nearly. And that's ancient elven ro- This is some seriously, uh, Gucci Kush right here. Oh my god. I really want it. I really, 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 really fucking want it. But it, I can't- I can't justify spending that fucking much here. Blank runestone. Oh yeah, we should start making our own runes, shouldn't we? I forgot we can do that. Oh man, you've got armor schematics to buy? Pretty good ones as well, as far as I can tell. Uh, should I bother? Maybe I'll buy the masterwork ones. Because obviously they can't be found anywhere else, as far as I know. Yeah, whatever. Fine. Ah, uh, we got the supply caches. Greetings to you. Nissa, Nissa. Oh yeah. You want bears, don't you? I haven't seen a single bear in this place. Are you gonna lead me to bears? Where are the bears at? It's very possible I've been running away from bears forgetting. Considering how much bears kick the ever-loving fuck out of me. But... I don't know, I don't want to leave the exalted plains without doing... doing the bear things. I... I don't know. Alright, let's get the hell out of here, shall we? Alright, so I googled it, and apparently we're gonna be stocking their fucking camp from miles and miles and miles and miles and miles away in the Emerald Graves, which is terrifying. Isn't that that elven burial ground or whatever, or has it still got Dalish in there? I'm hoping we get to interact with Dalish again, because I really, really enjoyed the very, very tiny appearance of all the Dalish here. I enjoyed doing some quests for elves for once. I want- I, I hope we can go to the Exalted Graves, or whatever the hell they're- not Exalted Graves, sorry, the Emerald Graves, or whatever the hell they're called, and actually hang out with some full-blown Dalish Elves, as opposed to three. Th three that apparently need a keeper in this tiny little hovel. Like, d what is that? Why can't we have many Dalish? I miss the big-ass camps. It was- the Brazilian Forest always did it best in, uh, Origins. But even in Dragon Age 2 with Sundermount, that was way better than everything we've seen here. The Dalish obviously still are around, and I want to see their presence. Um, I'm not annoyed that this uh, particular band of Dalish was a very, very tiny band of Dalish, because obviously there will be just nomadic groups like this. I don't know why they need a keeper, but whatever. Um, yeah, I just hope we do get to see massive groups of Dalish too. It will kind of be a kick in the dick if this is sort of the only... Um, appearance they really have as full blow as a full-blown society and everything i miss them i miss them so much i really really do i wish we could see Mo the maharial clan and everything even though i know that i still don't understand how the naming system works in um in elven culture or whatever but oh well okay i'm running all the way back up here because i want to see if uh what's her name the lady who was sort of in charge of all these Orlesians has another mission for us, because we've got all our supplies and everything. Please, oh god, please give me something other than a fetch quest. And uh, please give me the ability to teleport here. Why is there no fast travel? It's by far the biggest fortress we've captured. And no, we're not allowed to do shit. You guys still in here? Of course, of course. Good day to you too, Jadan. Or J Jihan, J Jihad. That's it. I came all this way just for that. 
Thanks, you insufferable bitch. Let's go. Back to Skyhold. Gonna send a few people on missions, and then we will see. Because I believe everyone's back now, right? Like, Cullen, Liliana, and Josephine all made their way back? I hope so. I don't think I sent anyone on an extremely long mission, unfortunately. All right, War Council. I'm gonna send them on the longest missions I possibly can, because I think this could be our last opportunity to do so today. So what do you got for me? Is everyone back? Where are you all? To and for Elden. Okay, serve any master from Leliana. That was simpler than I could than I than I would have hoped. The Imperial Counting House clerks were so shocked to have been discovered and so fearful of being found out. They have all, all but swore their loyalty to the Inquisition on the spot. My agents say that they are behaving themselves so far. Indeed, they sent gifts for you to prove their good faith. But we will watch them closely, nevertheless. In the meantime, any efforts we make to gather coin in Skyhold will undoubtedly benefit from their placement. Leliana, so just the same as the gold mine did. Purely because we have some dirty, dirty, filthy accountants. Alright. Wade! Such sheen to her scales! Oh, beauty indeed! Your gift will allow my imagination to take flight! Oh, such things! I have dreamed of crafting for so long! In return, Heron will send all my collected notes. A bit scattered, perhaps, but maybe your own smiths will find them of use. <laughs> Wade. <laughs> I miss Wade and Heron. I love me some Wade and Heron. I didn't make him quite as gay as he used to be, but whatever. Red Jenny and the Impostors. The Red Jenny Johi is suddenly efficient. The knights masquerading as our soldiers will not be doing so again. He is investigating who hired them in the first place. All right, well, Sarah is going to be a very happy bunny. Um, what do we got over here? Make contact the Emerald Graves, resources, 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 resources. Shade Dracolisk. I mean, I might as well. This one takes like five hours. Our researcher has been examining everything. Yep, we've already read this. If you wish the lure is placed, it will be done. I need Josephine for other things. Our allies will see the lure is properly placed and report well on the results. Having our soldiers place these lures in the designated areas is simple enough. I mean... Is it, though? Because I don't want my Shade Dracolisk or whatever getting arse-fucked on the way here. I, I don't want it disappearing. Right? Like, it wouldn't disappear, surely? Surely? Surely. Fuck it. Send... Right. Send Cullen. He's probably the least useful. Bye-bye. Ah... Uh, I really hope I didn't need him for something else. That would be really, really shitty. Really shitty indeed. I do actually really enjoy the war table, by the way. I should mention that. I think that is a really unique thing. I like being able to command. If I feel like the Herald here. I feel like I am planning shit. It's very fun. Um, Reese and Evangeline. Okay. Have I read this? No, I have not. Inquisitor, we have recovered from our wounds and are ready to serve the Inquisition as you see fit. Evangeline has friends among all Lysian nobility who may listen to our cause, and I am familiar with several caches used by the rebel mages. Or, if you, could pre if you would prefer, we would be honored to join the Inquisition troops near Val Furmin and fight the forces of Corypheus as best we can. Ah. I mean. I mean. I mean. I'm gonna send. What, what has she got? The caches? The Reese speaks of might yield something of value. A passionate warrior coming from a good fat. That's gold, we don't care. Experienced Templar and a powerful mage would greatly increase our military strength near Val Furman. Would it, though? I have seen how people who aren't in our party fight. And it, it, it's terrible. It really is. Um, I'm gonna send Liliana. I want those caches. It's a shame that that one only takes 51 minutes, but I mean, it's still something, right? Find the warden. Yes, yes, yes. We know what that is. Gather coin. There's gotta be something. Haven's Ruins. Who did I want here? 312, 248. This might be exactly what we need. Inquisitor. Per Is this a woman? Chromisius. A, a, a classy. Cool name. Per our conversation, I would like to. I would like permission to send some of the charges to Haven. Our goal is to find any gear lost in Corypheus' attack. Check for enemy stragglers and bring in refugees who have not yet find, found Sky. Bleh, bleh, found Skyhold. I feel like I probably should have done this forever ago then, because we've been in Skyhold for, well, just maybe a little over forever. Um. I think we should probably send Josephine then, right? The only way we will bring in refugees is through our allies in Ferelden. After Haven, they are more than willing to help. Hmm. 
Let I mean, it's got to be, right? Go on, Josephine. Do your thing. And that is where we will leave it. It's literally perfectly the time for me to stop as well, like dead on the hour. Hell yeah. All right. Well, um, I'm sorry we have to leave it on kind of a mundane note during the war table and everything, but I think that's going to be how I try to end things in every session so far. Um, once again, I do want to say, I do want to reiterate, I'm really enjoying this game. I know I shit on it, but that is because I adore Bioware with all I am. <laughs> I love Bioware so very much. The Mass Effect trilogy mean the world to me. Um, and I, I can't... And you know what? Dragon Age Origins and Dragon Age 2 I also really, really, really love. And I, I am loving this game. I just think it's a scary direction for Dragon Age to go down. But I am mostly blaming the rushedness and the Frostbite engine and all of that. Because, well, it's easy to blame and it's probably worth blaming. Sarah approves! Yay! Amulet of Willpower, Sigil of Lyrium. Sure. Anyway. Uh, yes, I am really enjoying the game. It just... It is reminiscent of where Bioware fucked up, right? And with Andromeda... I could be like, hey, it's just a messed up spin-off, you know, like that, just think of it as a spin-off, and it's just a fun, uh, pulpy, weird-ass little adventure outside of the main trilogy, instead of thinking of it as an actual sequel, and it, that really worked for me. When it comes to Inquisition, it is the direct sequel from 2, so I can't do that there. It's, it'd be like if Mass Effect 3 turned out to be like Andromeda was, um... Which, thankfully, did not happen. I actually think Mass Effect 3 is the best game in the trilogy, but I played it incredibly heavily modded, which got rid of, like, the Star Child and the terrible ending and stuff like that. I don't even know what the, what the terrible ending actually is to, to, yeah, to much extent, because I never actually, you know, had to put up with it. But yeah, it is just because I am worried about where Bioware are. But I do trust that Dragon Age 4... Definitely has potential to be amazing. Like I said before, um, and I know a lot of people say that the Bioware of old, the Bioware who did Mass Effect and the original Dragon Ages, a lot of people say that they're gone, you know, like that they won't, they're not the same Bioware, they won't be able to do the same things again. And while that is true, they are not the same studio as they once were in terms of their makeup, in terms of um, the wonderful developers and writers and everything that used to make those incredible experiences, you could say the same about Mass Effect was not the same Bioware that delivered Baldur's Gate. Mass Effect was not the same Bioware that delivered Jade Empire or KOTOR. Like, all those beloved fucking games, Neverwinter Nights and all that. It was always a different Bioware. You, you, I guess you sort of had a few mainstays through the majority of Bioware, but even then, like, only a few. And, um... Oh my god, I can't remember his name. The god of Bioware. What is your name? Oh no, I can't forget your name. Give me a second. Give me a second. I will remember this name. I I, I have to. <laughs> I love this man. Um. Casey. 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 Casey Hudson. That's it. There we go. I knew I'd remember it eventually. Um, he was sort of a mainstay. I, I can't remember when he showed up, but I don't think it was when Bioware were originally at their peak. I could be very wrong about this. But yes, um, obviously he was there. He delivered us Mass Effect. He delivered us uh, the, uh, the first Dragon Age, I believe, he was involved in. Um, which is obviously the best one. Um... And yeah, he's back. He's still here. He can do things, right? I don't know. Basically what I'm saying is I don't particularly buy into the whole Bioware are dead because it's not the same Bioware thing. Because bi the old, bi old, old Bioware were dead when Mass Effect came out. And Mass Effect is one of my favorite things in existence. So, you know, I can't necessarily buy into that. But anyway... I really hope you guys enjoyed. I really, really, really do. If you did, please do like, subscribe, share, comment, do all that amazing stuff. It really does help out both me and the channel. And I will see you in the next one. But for now, this is Strike, signing off. Goodbye.